See, coming to America, we didn't have many choices. Picking fruit or working in the factories. Back home, your dad was a skilled engineer. But that didn't matter here. Let's go, let's go! They just wanted cheap foreign labor. People willing to work longer hours for half the pay. And to work in conditions that no one else would. Mijo. ¿Me escuchas, papá? Sí, sí, sí. Te escucho muy bien. ¿Cómo estás? Te oigo muy lejos, papá. No, 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 no. Estoy aquí. ¿Cómo estás tú, mijo? Te extraño mucho. ¿Vas a regresar para mi cumple? Yo solo quiero que regreses. Pues eso espero, mijo. Eso espero. Y vas a ver el regalote que te voy a traer. ¿En serio? ¿Qué es? Ah, es una sorpresa. <laughs> una sorpresota, ya, ya verás. Because he knew he would have to work many years to earn enough to be able to come back home. He knew he had to find a faster way. A faster way to earn money. He knew what the factory was making would soon be obsolete. So he took a chance. It was a big risk if he got caught. But she was different than the others. She believed great ideas could come from anyone. Hey, where are you going? I gotta, I gotta go to the bathroom. Relax. So, what happened next? Your father finally found an ally. And soon they found an ally in each other. Together, they created a whole new product for the company. After years of struggling, Flavia would soon be able to come back home. And to celebrate their success, he took her to the one place where he felt safe and welcome. <laughs> but he knew he made a grave mistake. If he had stayed here a little bit longer, he could have saved all the money he needed. But that didn't matter to him anymore. The only thing that mattered to him was getting back to you 